All right, today going to do a video on this little uh, 1x4 sweep tube amplifier I picked up. Well, actually, it was gifted to me because um, it was a dusty, dirty kind of a garage find and it didn't have tubes in it, so somebody gave it to me. So at first, I was going to use it for parts because I'm like, it's got a pretty healthy transformer there nice plate choke uh, that blocking cap I put in and uh, before I cleaned it up it was pretty rough looking but um, after I dusted it and and all that and I didn't like the black color I'm like ah, yuck but then I looked at the components and uh, how it was built and I'm like hey somebody put some work into this thing and uh, use some pretty good components for a sweep tube amplifier so I'm like I think I could do something with this so um, we went through it a little bit changed a couple things around and uh, I think it's a nice uh, working little sweep tube amplifier there um, Pi circuit for the uh, driver tune and load which are up here and then um, another pie circuit there tune and load for the finals got two lights one of them comes on when you turn it on and the other one um, comes on when you key it up and uh, over here in the top it has the meter which is a, a quick spade disconnect um, so you can unplug it and also there's a um, pretty robust fan in the back that um, plugs in if I can get to that plug there to the uh, back of the amp there uh, when it's running so that's what it looks like on the insides I'm like that's pretty well made despite the looks so I cleaned it up and I'm like, well, that came out pretty good, you know, just from cleaning and a little elbow grease. And with that nice big transformer, I'm like, ah, it's a little bit too nicely built at this part away. So um, I dug up some tubes. I guess I knocked them over here. I had just made myself a little output um, 6LQ6 tester. So I tested these at actual output, not a, just a tube tester test, but a RF output test. And um, I had some that were 100 and 110, but I'm like, I'm not going to put those in here. I put some that uh, were less than 100 that I had laying around. So I put some 90s, and I think there's a 95 and even an 80 in there. So I put them in there, and... Uh, this thing does a couple hundred uh, bird watts. Um, it's about three um, um, dozy or peak watts. I'm setting the camera down. I'm going to flip it over. Hopefully put the cover on right quick. I need a third hand. And uh, plug her in and all that when I get done. And uh, let's see what she does right quick. <laughs> So we're going to plug the fan in the back. And I think I'm all good. So that's what she looks like uh, with the cover on. It would sit up higher and a little better if I had the uh, bottom cover on. But it's off. And if I can find the plug. And plug her in. Turn her on. Let her warm up for a few. Okay, we got around standby. Over here we got power switch, standby off and on, and then an AM SSB is just a delay for a relay. And uh, that's tune and load, and then on the side is driver, tune and load. And we got a, somebody put the meter, um, it's just uh, screwed in there. It kind of sticks out on the front. And like I said, uh, on light and then when you key down the little blue light lights to like, indicate that you're uh, keyed down and that's about it and I guess while we're warming up we usually show what the uh, 
trusty Tram Titan is doing over there. So we're on a dummy load, of course, and let's put the watt meter on the 20. And just with the radio on, I'm dead, dead keen about a lot. Going about three, that's all I'm putting into it. And it uh, should be ready by now, so let's go to the 200. Turn it on, and hopefully she's still tuned up. And she's dead keen about 70. Audio. Audio, audio, talking about 130. Um, getting about 160 on a whistle. Hello, hello, hello. Audio, if I retuned it, I probably could get a little bit more out of it there. There is no high and low on it. Or no power adjust, so probably get a lot more out of it if I uh, throw it a little harder but that's all the uh, trusty Crown Titan 4 is doing today audio and last I'm gonna put her on peak oh uh, well, do it over 200 peak let's go to 2000 watt scale audio Audio. I'm eh, hitting about 275 right now. If I tweaked her up a little bit, probably can hit about three peak. So that's going to be it on this homemade, I guess, no name, uh, one driving four, 6LQ6 amplifier. Also, it probably do uh, another hundred, maybe even more if you um, put better tubes in there. But uh, I'm not going to put my 100% uh, plus tubes. Uh, in this amp, this uh, those tubes are worth a lot of money. So that's it for the uh, no name one driving four for today. Bye.